So yesterday I won my 12th 5K running race, 5,000 meters, my 12th win of the year. And I uh, just wanted to share that with people. <laughs> Had 12 wins out of 13 starts. Anyway, so the question was, Yo, 30 bananas a day eating, bitch, you scrawny motherfucker. Keith and Raj don't sell supplements, fool. Well, the reality is, they do sell supplements. They do sell supplements, and that's cool, but if you go down their link below, they've got an affiliate link with bodybuilding.com. And that's cool, you know, like, I used to sell protein powders myself. I used to sell creatine. I worked in the gym. You know, I've trained with uh, people on steroids and all sorts, man. I, I know what the deal is. I know what time it is. So when people go on my channel and say, don't sell supplements, blah, 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 they do. And that's fine. That's cool. You know, doesn't make people bad people if you sell supplements and, you know, have affiliate links. That's cool, man. Everyone's making coin these days. It's, that's fine. My question is, if Keith and Roger, is it Keith and Roger? And uh, the twin muscle workout, the guys. You know, I think they've got some good things to say. You know, they've got some good training tips and, you know, just good, good things to say, you know. I'm just critiquing and sharing my comments on their dietary advice. So if the muscle twin dudes were so positive about their diet gives such protein sufficiency, then how come they sell protein powders to the viewers? How come they take protein powders? You know, I've heard the, I've heard the twin muscle crew say that if you're a vegan, you don't get enough protein. So you've got to eat meat. And you've got to buy the whey protein powder as well. <laughs> if you're a vegan, you won't have enough energy. So eat meat and take Jacked 3D. And take one more, the, what's it called? The one more rep? <laughs> I mean, that's like, that's just like a white powder fucking... That's crazy shit, man. That's like adrenaline. That's, that's like adrenal burnout, man. You take that stimulant shit. If you if you don't have enough energy to train, you shouldn't train, man. You burn yourself out. Get off that fucking intermittent fasting bullshit. Eat some breakfast, man, and train smart. Don't get, don't rely on stimulants to train because you read some blog that intermittent fasting is good, man. That fuck your shit up. That fuck up your recovery, dog. You know? It's just like, what are you thinking, man? <laughs> I can't eat, so I'm gonna have some fucking caffeine powder and go do one more rep. <laughs> and then when I get adrenal burnout and blow out, so, you know, again, it's nothing personal, just share my comments and criticisms. I'm a personal trainer, I wanna help people. Bottom line, man, I wanna help people. So, if you get enough protein on your meat diet, how come you have to have whey protein? Now, the reality is, if twin muscle workout, if they stop doing their protein powders and creatine, all that fake muscle they got would just psh, just dissolve off because it's just water retention. Strength is when you're a competitive level power lifter. You type in your weight and you type in how much you should be able to deadlift or bench press and you'll find out how weak you are. If you want to be a strong man, then you go lift heavy weights. <laughs> now, I'm a runner, I'm a cyclist, but I've trained strength and I've trained strength athletes. I know what time it is. You know what I mean? I know what fucking time it is. So when people come and tell me that you don't get enough protein if you're vegan and they're guzzling fucking whey protein powder and they're selling whey protein powder, I'm going to tell them what time it is. <laughs> so your diet's deficient if you have to take protein powder. And I apologies, I'm sorry in advance, if you have a genetic protein malabsorption issue and you have to take a protein on my apologies. This is more about the people who say... Blah, 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 you know. And why do you have to take a protein powder supplement if you get enough protein from your meat and your egg diet? And so you've got to get up to speed, man. Eating all that animal cholesterol is going to give you a heart attack, man. Check out Dr. Esselstein's book, Prevent and Reverse Heart Disease. Get up to speed, man. Look at the dangers of dairy. Chinastudy.com. Check this shit out, Dr. Campbell. So I want to get people fit and healthy, man, because... What's the point of having big puffy pecs and creatine and whey powder if your cholesterol is through the roof? And the increasing chance of bowel cancer, man. Think, dog, think. So people often ask me, Harley, you're a vegan. You must have to take some special protein powder, yeah? And I'm like, no. And they're like, well, 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 where do you get your protein from? And I'm like, where do you get your protein from? No, 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 answer my question. I'm like, okay, I'll get my protein from whole plant foods. Where do you get your protein from? Do you take a protein powder? And they're like, yeah, I'll take a protein powder. I'm like, so you're protein deficient. You have to take a protein powder, otherwise your muscles shrink. 
That's how protein deficient you are. So you come and tell me I'm protein deficient, but like without your little whey protein powder, you got no muscles. It's all just psh, just puff. No creatine, no whey powder. You shrink. <laughs> you shrink, man. So just share my comments and criticisms, man. Nothing personal. Just saying, man. Just saying. So eat healthy, man. Eat healthy. Train smarter versus harder. Don't get suckered in to this newbie noobs, man. And uh, that's all I gotta say.